maximum alert. If the doctor is involved, look out for a police telephone call. Look out for what? Knowledgeable fellow. <laughs> it's one way of putting it. He's got this thing about King Arthur. Digs things up out of the ground by the lake. Well, he is an archaeologist. <laughs> Can't see it myself, all that patient scraping about. You know, I get the urge to bung half a kilo of TNT down the hole, <laughs> bring it all up in one go. Now you're talking. The point of archaeology is to carefully recover the past, not disintegrate it. Wouldn't make much difference. The only half decent thing Peter's ever found is that scabbard. Use something with more breezins. More breezins? Then try nitrotolerine. Like what? How remarkable. Tell you outside. Why outside? He gets upset when I talk about explosives. <laughs> Interesting, isn't it? Yes. I wish I could see what it looks like. I can feel its presence sometimes. Touch it. No, 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 it's cold. Every so often I get the strangest feeling about it. What kind of feeling? That it's waiting for something. Stupid, really. Waiting for something. Or someone. It still fits. I should have thrown it out while I had the chance. And that too. You could have said no. I could have, Doris. But I still have my duty. This isn't duty. You want to go. I mean, do I... I... All this means so little to you. I will be coming back. You don't need to go. You don't need to go on playing soldier anymore. I'm not playing. There is the enemy. Kill him. Well, I mean, <laughs> it was obvious I was never going to be the world's greatest artist. Anyway, Mrs. Parkinson, the art teacher, asked me what it is, right? So I told her it was a lump of school plasticine. <laughs> Well, I couldn't tell her what it really was. The homemade gel ignite. <laughs> <laughs> We're in the school corridor by now. And Mrs. Parkinson asked me to put what she thinks is school plasticine back in the art room. So what did you do? I tossed it over my shoulder. Like that. <laughs> Landed right in the middle of Class 1C's prize winning pottery pig collection. And boom! 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 Just hit the brewery! We better get the doctor. Good idea. 
Did you see it? Yeah. And? It looked like a bloke. A bloke? Flying through the air? And then through a wall. You two stay here. Oh, be serious, Professor. What's going on? Oh, you better ask the Professor. What's going on? Against all hope. He has many names, but in my reckoning, he is Merlin. You recognize my face, then? No, not your aspect, but your manner that betrays you. Do you not ride the ship of time? Does it not deceive the senses being larger within than without? Merlin, cease these games and tell me truly, is this the time? Time for what? Thou does not know, truly. Do you think he'd be asking if he did, Tinhead? Why, the answer to Excalibur's call, the time of restitution. Time when Arthur rises to lead the Britons to war. Vartican's Lake, of course. Can you walk? Can someone Aye. answer a simple question? What's wrong, Doctor? Can someone tell me what on earth is going on? Well, if my hunch is right, the Earth could be at the centre of a war that doesn't even belong to this dimension. Freeze! Everyone stand nice and easy. Listen, Winifred, we've got to be somewhere urgently, so please get out of the way. You're under arrest, you and your freaky friends. Who are you calling freaky? I think I, I can sort this out. Look, if I can just explain. Kill them! Kill them now! What can you see? A flying machine. It is like an ornithopter, but with whirling blades for wings. The people of this world are obsessed with machinery. It would seem so. Well then. Let us teach them the limitations of their technologies. Malfunction, sir! What? It felt like something hit us. This could be rough. What's down there? Don't ask me. I've only been excavating this site for ten years. With a bit of luck, a tunnel. A dark, mysterious one. Probably. Leading to unknown dangers. Indubitably. Oh, wicked. Peter, Ace and I have got to investigate this tunnel. You stay here and guard it. Don't let anyone come in here. What am I supposed to do? Lecture them in archaeology? Yes. Can you get us down? Down is not the problem. Well, we are under the lake. And this wall's made of concrete. Mm. It's gone soft with age. This was built in the 8th century. But they didn't have concrete in those days. No, they didn't. I thought so. Doctor. Oh, don't worry, Ace. It's only a trap. I've 
million pounds worth of aircraft and we've lost it. If you make us pay for that. We'll be poor for the rest of our lives. Uh. Pull the ligament. Oh, good. I thought there might be something serious. <laughs> I'll see if I can get some help from the village. Sir, we don't know what the situation is here. The situation, Lavelle, is normal. It doesn't get much worse than that. You know, I think I'm rather enjoying this. Is a shrine to those fallen in battle. So, they are not the savages you led us to believe. You fought on their soil without proper respect for the dead. Mother, you I... You have dishonored us, Mordred. What is victory without honor? Leave us! Man, are you? A oh, warrior, no less. How goes the day? I've had better. I am Morgane, the Sun Killer, dominator of the Thirteen Worlds and Battle Queen of the Sprax. What say you? I am Brigadier Lethbridge Stewart. Surrender now, and we can avoid bloodshed. No coded pattern? No hidden switches. Well, how are we going to get through the door, then? Open up! It's me! I wish you to know that I bear you no malice. I understand. But when we meet again, I shall kill you. I refuse to ask how you did that. How did you do that? Well, it came to me that it wasn't Anselin's people who built this tunnel. It was Merlin. But everyone thinks that you're Merlin. Exactly. Door key to my voice pattern. Just the sort of thing I would do. Are you Merlin? No. But I could be. In the future. That is my personal future. Which could be the past. Right. Commandeering this car, miss. Sorry. The keys, please. What? The keys. Thank you. Hey, just a moment. This is my car. Seen one spaceship, you've seen them all. Don't be so cynical, Ace. Impressive. That's Arthur, King of the Britons, isn't it? The legendary Arthur, yes. From another dimension. Where well, the man was closer to the myth. But what is he doing here? Not a lot. Is he in suspended animation? Who knows? In eternal sleep until England's greatest need. Yes, don't touch that. Oh, it's all right, Professor. It's not like I'm king of the Britons, is it? No, I hope you haven't disturbed anything. You disturbed me? Well, I hope you haven't disturbed anything else. Like what? Like that. Look. Where? I think I saw something. Over there. Ace, I think it's time for plan B. We run. Yes! Run! Defense system, isn't it? Yes. Why 
they say run? Run! Not that way! So true is a dead end! Hang on, Ace! is where Arthur is supposed to have met Mordred in the final battle. And this lake, where Bedivere threw Excalibur. What do you know of Excalibur? King Arthur saw an Excalibur wrought by the lonely maiden of the lake, who rose up out of the water, holding the sword Excalibur aloft. This lake? Thou rememberest how, in those old days, one summer noon, an arm rose up from out the bosom of the lake, clothed in white samite, mystic, wonderful, holding the sword. It's all a myth, really. Look! It's that wretched girl. <laughs> what are you doing in the lake? Drowning. He can be king of England. There's Excalibur. That's what I said, Shakespeare. Where's the doctor? In a spaceship. Down there! He's in trouble. We've got to help him. Oi! Truly. The time of restitution has come. Come out, come out, where you I just can't let you out of my sight, can I, Doctor? Brigadier Alistair Gordon Lethbridge Stewart. Do you recognize me then? Yes. Who else would it be? Who are you? What do you want? Pat! Come quickly, Patrick! Two people were down there and you didn't tell me. Well, I. Down there in a trap. Yeah, it lets you in, but it doesn't let you out. Yes, well, Ace got out all right. But the Doctor is still down there. And the Brigadier. I am the Brigadier. So am I. Hey, I thought it let you in, but it doesn't let you out. It let me out. Brigadier, I thought you'd retired. So did I, Brigadier. Knight Commander. My lady. Take your men along that road. Seek out those who hold Excalibur and take the sword from them. And if they resist? Give them an honorable death. Oh, they breed their children strong on this world. No matter. There shall be an end to these games. Be more! 
Audrey! Audrey! Is your army not enough to give you courage? Courage? <laughs> to face you, Anselin, who fled the field at Camlan? Anselin the Craven, I call you! What care I for the words of a half man who cowers from a woman's wrath? This is no battle, it is but a ruse, a diversion. My mother hath summoned the Destroyer, the Lord of Darkness, Eater of Worlds. Look to your children, Merlin, for soon they shall be no more. Peace, my done. Gain of the Fae. I am power beyond your imagining. Surrender to me what is mine by right of conquest. Give me Excalibur. Never! Then you shall be given over to the Destroyer. Become his handmaidens in hell. <laughs> It's not good at all. I can have an airstrike here in minutes. It's no good, Brigadier. Conventional weapons won't harm it. No, I didn't think so. Ace, give me the silver bullets. How did you know? Silver bullets will do the trick. How did you know I had them? It's all a matter of timing, Ace. Give me your gun. What, those will stop the destroyer? What, you just uh, shoot the bullets into it? Simple, isn't it? Just like most killings. Lord, is that a spaceship? You scumbag! Sorry, Doctor, but I think I'm rather more expendable than you are. This world shall be mine. And then another. And another. Get off my world. We've got to stop him. Pitiful. Can this world do no better than you as a champion? Probably. <laughs> I just do the best I can. Battle's not over yet. You stupid, stubborn, thick-headed numbskull! You're supposed to die in bed. I can handle it. Your job. Nonsense, Doctor. This must be dead. Oh, really, Doctor? You don't think I'd be so stupid as to stay inside you? Well... Really, Doctor, have a little faith. Ace? Yes, Brigadier? I'm getting too old for this sort of thing. He's all yours from now on. I'm going home to Doris. Doris? Yes, my wife. Ha, ha, ha. So she cut you in the end. Yeah. Oi, shouldn't we be getting back? Yes, Ace is right. I suspect there's some clearing up to be done. Yes, just a small nuclear missile bogged down a nature reserve. Hey, so have you no sense of occasion? No. Listen, she is alive. 
Which is more than can be said for Arthur the freeze dry. This is very odd. Will you put him there? I will put him there. What's wrong, Doctor? Where is the king? Doctor, this is for you. What does it say? Dear Doctor, King died in final battle. Everything else propaganda. Who signed it? The Doctor. Oh, well, that sorts that out. P.S. Morgan has just seized control of the nuclear missile. I've got to give myself more warning. Brigadier, you race. See to the ship. Explosives, Doctor. Now you're talking. Yes, we'll give Arthur a warrior's burial. with honor. All over the world, fools are poised, ready to let death fly. Machines of death, Morgane, are screaming from above. A light brighter than the sun. Not a war between armies, nor a war between nations, but just death, death gone mad. A child looks up into the sky, his eyes turn to cinders. No more tears, only ashes. Is this honor? Is this war? Are these are weapons we would use? Tell me! No. And put a stop to it, Morgan. End the madness. Then tell Arthur to face me with honor in single combat. Merlin, Prince of Deceit. Another trick? No. I don't believe you. Don't you? It can't be. He died over a thousand years ago. Arthur, who burned like starfire. Gone. And was as beautiful. Where does he lie? I would look at him one final time. He's gone to dust. Then I shall not even have that comfort. I shall never see him again. Arthur. We were together in the woods of Celadon. The air was like honey. I'm sorry, Morgan. It's over. Don't forget to click below to subscribe to the official Doctor Who YouTube channel. What? <laughs>